now during compiling, when compiler converts the source code to an OBJ code, so whatever the errors you get, that is, for example, you might have not given a semicolon. So those errors are been listed by compiler and such errors are called as a syntax errors or else compiler errors. The errors which you get during compiling, we call them as in compiler errors. So those errors are the one, if you violate any language rules, such errors comes under the category of an compiler errors or else you can call it as an syntax errors. In same way, now while converting from OPJ file to an EXE file, that is by linker, linker will convert an OBJ file to an EXE file. During that time also you will get an error. For example, instead of giving your printf, let's take for example, you might have given by mistake here as an print. So what linker tries to do is it will go and searches in this included file whether the print function is present or not. If it doesn't find in that stdio.h print function, so linker will give fire an error. Such errors are called as an linker errors. Okay. So you will get linker errors when you misspell the functions. Okay, whenever you try misspell the function names. So in such a cases, you get an linker errors. Now after linking, you'll get an executable file. Okay, once you get an executable file, you'll try to run the program. So during execution of the program also, there's a possibility that you may give, get an error. For example, you might have given an expression here rather than giving g equals to a plus b, you might have given a g is equals to a divided by b. So let's assume that g, b value is equals to zero and that means you're trying to divide this 10 by zero. In such a cases, you will get an runtime error. You cannot divide any number by zero. So you get an runtime error. Okay. So during execution of the program, you get an error. Such errors are called as an runtime errors. Okay. So these are the three types of now there's one more possible error that is a logical error. That is actually you want to find the sum. So you have to give your g is equals to a plus b. By mistake, assume that instead of giving g equals to a plus b, in a program you might have given your g equals to a minus b. So in such a cases, your compiler will not fire any error message, your linker also will not fire. During runtime also you will not get any error, but you, when you run the program, you get a wrong results. So such errors are called as an logical errors. So these are the four types of errors you come across while developing the, developing as well as while running the programs.